Say something, I'm giving up on you. I'll be the one if you want me to. True love is a myth. Only fools believe in it. Fools who crave Anywhere for something to believe in. People say love is the closest thing we have to magic. <laughs> but magic doesn't exist either. Of course, we love our families, our siblings, parents, friends. But true love? True love is bullshit. I believe in the mere exposure effect. The more time you spend with someone, and the longer you are around him or her, the more you start to love them. But then you don't see them for months. Things change. Maybe you still care about the person, and maybe you always will. But you slowly start to lose the connection you once had. The feelings slowly become less and less. You meet someone else. Someone with very similar interests as you. Someone easy to talk to, who makes you laugh until you cry. You fall in love and forget about the one you once claimed was your one and only love. The mere exposure effect. And hypothetically speaking, let's say there is one person out there meant for you. One person who you are 100% meant to be with. You won't find him. He could be thousands of miles away from you, over mountains and oceans, on the complete opposite side of the world. What? Are you going to spend your whole life searching for him? No. Instead, you're going to find someone closer to you who you love. Someone who's the nearest possible thing you could have to true love. You may actually believe you have found the one, but you haven't. You just happened to grow up in the same town as him, so you hung out and enjoyed spending time together. You spend every second of every day together over the summer. Then, college comes, and you promise you'll try to stay together, that you'll try to make it work, but it won't. Distance hardly ever works. The mere exposure effect. I'm not saying you won't miss each other, and I'm not saying you won't always care about each other, because you will. But you'll both meet new people. People with similar interests, who make you laugh, who are easy to talk to, who you spend time with every day, who you enjoy spending time with. This so-called love comes and goes. You love someone, and then it ends. You love someone else, and then it ends. You love someone else, it ends. True love is stupid. Destiny is stupid. It doesn't exist. The entire time we were dating, I ignored the fact that everyone told me not to trust Matt. I ignored the fact that he had hurt dozens of girls before me. And I believed him when he told me he could never be truly happy without me. I believed him when he told me he couldn't go one day without seeing me. I believed him when he told me he and Katie were just friends. And I believed him when he told me he loved me. I 100% trusted him and trusted how he felt about me. But it turns out our entire relationship was a lie. I have to thank him though, for teaching me what a destructive relationship is and not to get caught up in one ever again. However, he also taught me that it's unlikely to find one person who you'll be happy with for the rest of your life. He taught me not to open up to people so easily. He taught me not to trust people. And most importantly, he taught me that true love doesn't exist.